to have a good setup from the scrum, you need good speed across the ground in terms of entry to the scrum, and the scrum needs to be at the right depth and height. And lastly, there is constant pressure through the front row. Let's start with the correct setup. Firstly, the player will check his depth and height, and then ensure that his chest is in front of his knees and an appropriate distance away from the scrumming machine. So on entry, we should have the perfect pushing position. What we look for in the perfect pushing position is firstly the angle of the hips. In other words, the angle from the stomach to the knees should be 120 degrees. And we also want a 120 degree angle between the hamstring and the calf. After the engagement, the ideal angle to push up is at 5 degrees. You need to be careful that the players don't hyperextend or overextend through the lower back area. If we have all these in place, then we pretty much have as close to as possible the perfect scrumming position. Points to remember on the setup are sticking one's pelvis out, sticking one's chest out and ensuring it is as far in front of your feet as possible. Checking your height and depth, normally an arm's length from the machine and from the ground. Ensure that your head and neck position is flat and not too up. If it's too much in the up position, then it tends to drop on engagement, which in turn leads the player to hitting down and not at a 5 degree angle, which we're looking for. An analogy for this is raising one's eyebrows or looking over the top of one's sunglasses.